When I was about six years old, uh, my mother and I moved over to Australia to join my dad. But because neither of them could speak fluent English and we didn't really have a lot of financial help, the only thing that my parents could do was to work as street vendors selling various toys and souvenirs that they imported over from China. And I would help my parents sell these products in the street. And I, I never really thought much of it. I just thought, you know, as a kid, I was an only child. And I just thought that's just how life was. It was a struggle. And I was different to the kids at school who could just get on with their work and didn't have to think about helping their parents earn money. But on the flip side, you know, watching my parents be very entrepreneurial and not letting any obstacles, be it language or a new country, to find what their future would be, it just came really naturally to me that I would start a side hustle alongside my education to sell something at a market stall. And I made the only product that I knew how, which was a body scrub. And I didn't have any money for packaging and fancy stickers and all that. It didn't look great, but I had great product on the inside and it sold really well and that's how I kind of started my brand. I learned from a very early age that you don't need to have huge amounts of funding and research and all sorts of things to start up a business, that your business can start with a bit of passion, determination and a few jam jars. <laughs>